we understand that many of the people who read our book and many of our colleagues are not necessarily sympathetic to um, to conservative populism and um, to conservatism as a uh, as a political cause. Um, and they may not um, share conservatives normative judgments about these things. But I think when conservatives complain or critique or just observe that in many ways the country is moving left, um, we think they're actually right about that. We think they're objectively onto something. We have lots of evidence in the book um, to, to sort of show that that is true. And um, there's no way in our view to understand the rise of conservative populism and the backlash to progressive technocracy without understanding that it is built on, on some really true changes, perceptions um, among certain subgroups of Americans that they are, um, that they're losing ground, that they're losing ground, not just economic ground, but losing cultural importance and relevance. Um, and so that's part of the story we tell in the book and, and pop culture, which political scientists often sort of, you know, ignore or look down their nose at or don't think is important or relevant. We actually think it's really important and really relevant. Absolutely. Um, and really helps understand larger changes um, in American society. 